All right, toasty, toast, toast, toast. Yeah. Good fortune. Good, Good fortune. fortune. <laughs> We're back again at the Handlebar celebrating a very special edition of Scam Nation. We have Jason, John, and Tyler. John, it's your birthday? It is, yeah. Now I'm going to sing. All of a sudden, everyone comes in and starts clapping in unison, and they feed you a cake. Like, <laughs> embarrassing. <laughs> okay. yes. I got a fun one for you guys. As you know, on Scam Nation, you have openers, tweeners, closers. Closers are these unbustable puzzles. I'd seen, you guys have seen like uh, chess puzzles where it's like it's the final configuration and they say, what's the right move to mm. mate in one? Yes. This is like the grade school version of that. <laughs> Do you guys remember the game uh, Dots and Lines where you, yeah. you took turns yeah. making yeah. lines and whoever whoever Get whoever boxes. claimed a box, you, yeah. you got to claim it, right? I'm gonna set you up with a puzzle that comes from the brilliant puzzle master Sam Lloyd from like a hundred years ago. This stuff is so super, super Jeez. old, which is why I love getting fooled by the old stuff. Okay, so let's say we've got two players. Uh, uh, Hitler's the bad guy. Who's the good guy? Uh, uh, Gandhi. Gandhi, okay, Gandhi versus oh. Hitler. We want Gandhi to win. Yes, it's Gandhi's so. turn. Yes. Okay. It's Gandhi's so, turn. So, so uh, and this is how they played so far. Now the thing is, Gandhi could complete that but then Hitler would do this, and he would put his, his tails up quarter there, and then he would get another move, because every time he closed one, you get another move. Yeah, just, and yeah. he would just keep on going, yeah. and then, and then uh, he, he would eventually, he would get one, two, three, four, and uh, here's the important part. Not only would he get four, but he would be able to put this one here, thereby guaranteeing him the win. Wherever Gandhi goes, there's gonna be a box waiting to be closed, yeah. and then Hitler will get the majority of the, uh, so, oh, that, that, that rascal Hitler. Yeah, Hitler. Hitler, damn you Hitler. <laughs> okay. So we know that we don't want to set that up right. with this move right here. So the question is, how can Gandhi win this? Now keep in mind, Hitler is competent enough that we've gotten to this part, so whatever you do, will play out as if Hitler, you know, is not an idiot. But there is a way for Gandhi to force the win in this exact Dots and Boxes game. So feel free to play it out, try some different stuff. Okay. Who wants to be Gandhi first? Uh, oh, that's, uh, I'll, I'll be Gandhi, I'll, I'll be Gandhi. Gandhi. <laughs> wow. I'll be Gandhi. Start protesting Gandhi. salt taxes. Gandhi. I'm thinking like this guy right here. Ah, but then that, that, that closes on, that off, but no. it limits it only to three. Are you guys literally trying to appease Hitler? <laughs> <laughs> give give Hitler his Poland here. <laughs> I mean, but then and he closes this off. And so we get so the rest let's of that. let's say if you did, let's say you gave okay. Hitler Poland, then that would be one for Hitler, two for Hitler, three for Hitler, and then I I guess I would spend my yeah, but. My next one here, yeah, and then that would force you to, yeah, yeah. Because then there's one, two, one, 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 there. two, one, yep. two, one, two, one, two, yeah, yeah. Okay, all right, all right. So what are your other options? So like, let's pull them like right here, so like okay. that, this, right there. Because that doesn't give them, it doesn't give Hitler anything for it free. It doesn't give him anything. Yeah. But what if I did that, and then at this point, <laughs> then. Uh, Oh, man, it's yeah. Then we're, we're definitely dead. dead. Yeah. Right, because you have to close this gap, at which point Hitler takes yeah, everything. There's, there's two or you close that gap, time. and then Hitler takes everything, right? right? So that's probably not it. Damn you, Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> what happens if we just, let's try it. Let's just try it. Put something like here. Yep. Okay, okay. Ooh, so I, I would like say okay. most, okay, so here's what, I, here's what Hitler, not me, uh, would do. Uh, I believe he would go here. Okay. But then we would do that, 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 and you would get four. that. Well, no, no, no. You would do that, 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 and you would lock in four. But you would have to, on your next and bonus we give move, up the rest. close up. Yeah, at that point, he takes he takes it all. But we need to somehow secure this because there's more here than there are here. Right, right. So what yeah. if we? Here's just an idea. Sure. We just oh, it's something in this area. But like, what happens if we do something like even like this? Okay. So it's we, something in this area. So, so let's say you did that, right? Yeah. yeah. Then, then Hitler would grab oh, that, that and would, he would grab, grab this, uh, and then he would grab this. That one. Yep. And then he would grab this. And then the question is, what would Hitler do to screw you guys over afterwards? Okay. I feel um, like. I mean, put one here. Well, if he did that, then we only get one. That one. Yeah, that's right. right. That's what Hitler would do. Yes. And so, so what would you do in this situation? So if he put that there, we'd be screwed in this situation. We put here, and then he at that point, the Hitler gets everything. Right. We put it here, yeah. he gets the rest. Anywhere in here, he gets the rest. Yeah. Yeah. And if we go here, then yeah, we get this one, but then we have to put one down. 
and then, yeah. and then he gets the and rest of those. Yeah. yeah. So it's not it's not that. Now here's what's great about being the quiz master when you're at the bar is like you get to sit back and give hints, and I will give you the hint that you guys are right. The solution is in this. Is is in what you do in this yeah. section. So not there. And we already tried like either of this does the same thing. Here or here. You want you want to double check? Try that. So at that point, that then Hitler, Hitler, will Hitler, put Hitler, in. Hitler, Hitler, and then and then he divides you again. It seems like this is the important part yeah. that he uh, he gives he forces you guys to make a choice that, that ends up with you only having one square. Right. I think that. So then at this point, Hitler completes the snake, and so you're trapped is that with the. Uh, yeah, because you have to play either here or here. And either way, Hitler takes everything. This is one of my favorite parts of a Scam Nation episode yeah. when we all grasp it, and there is a solution, but but it requires this intuitive leap because you can kind of feel that we're going through all the moves, but there's something we're not seeing. Okay, okay. All right, what if I promised you guys that the solution involves one very novel cognitive leap that none of us are really making so far? Okay. Would that be worth a beer? Okay, all right, all right, all right. I'd pay a beer for that. Okay, <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'll offer you a money back guarantee. If you don't think there's an aha moment, I'll buy the beer. <laughs> there are a few ways this could play out, but if you assume Hitler knows what he's doing, the best move, and I think you did it at one point, is to yep, give this that. one. Yeah, yeah. And okay. there is a partial appeasement strategy, but there'll be a moment that you guys can gobble up all four of those, but you have to resist the temptation and instead only gobble up two. So if you make this move, what? let's say Hitler <laughs> closes that off. He's like, I'm going to give you these four because I know I'll get these five. Yeah. Okay. So you guys would, of course, you would gobble up Oh, we're going to cut them off. Right? Uh, and then you would gobble up two. And at this point, Hitler's all super excited. Yeah. He's like, you're going to gobble them up and I'm going <laughs> to gobble up these. But then instead of continuing to gobble these up, you set the trap for him. So ah. he's got a choice where either he sets you up for all of these ah, or gobbles up oh, these two. Really nice. And then at that point, now you guys get to gobble up the rest. Isn't that brilliant? Oh, dude. It's wow. so good. That, that resisting Jeez. of the initial urge. Yeah. Dude, you guys were fantastic. I'm so glad dude, that you guys grasped awesome. all that. That was, that was awesome. awesome. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Good, Good fortune. fortune. <laughs> hey.